The next question is a person is saying I have sinned a lot and I have lost all Iman I had. Do you have any advice on how I can become a better human being? Yes. Right now, man. Right now. Turn to Allah and say, oh Allah, forgive me. That simple. That simple. What separated Islam from any other religion? There's no middleman in Islam. You don't need to sit in a box or put some money in a box or sit in front of a human being and confess to this and con no between you and Allah right now right now between you and Allah say oh Allah forgive me know that Allah will forgive you nobody will be able to understand your pain but Allah so talk to Allah, connect with Him. It will help you. It will give you a reason to look forward to tomorrow. Be extra careful what you post on the World Wide Web. Many people are going through difficulties, are going through hardships. Huh? If just telling someone about your blessings, you could end up losing it, subhanAllah. Then how about if they actually ended up seeing it? I'll say that again. You telling someone about your blessings, you could end up losing it. And how about the person who's actually sitting at home, miserable, depressed, stressed out because of what he's going through and then ends up seeing it? The evil eye is not a joke, brothers. This is why I always say, a happy life is a secret life. A happy life is a secret life. Anytime you see a beautiful video where there is a good teaching of Allah Almighty, like it, share it and make a small comment. Because the day you meet with Allah, your fingers will bear witness and entire humanity, whoever saw it and witnessed it and whoever benefited from it, you get a full reward for everyone. Sitting in, what did you do? I just liked it, shared it, commented. That's it. Allah created you. He has a plan for you. He knows what the plan is. So lay your trust in Him. He has that plan. Nothing is impossible for Allah. It's just impossible for us as humankind. With Allah, there's no impossibility. When Allah wants something, be and it is. Continue asking Allah and do not lose hope and continue remain as steadfast as possible. It is Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala who will open your doors. Wallahi, they will open one day. And if Allah does not open those doors in this world, the fact that you continued and had hope and continued with patience and forbearance, He will fling open the doors of paradise and ask you to enter from whichever door you want. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant us all Jannah.